man, what's up guys? Oh, man, this, it's been crazy. We just got out of the shower. It's 3.29 a.m. Oh, man, it's, I haven't been uploading because uh, I'm not making any excuses. I just, I've made the content. I just haven't uh, uploaded it just for the fact that I've been traveling. And oh my God, I'm tired. But I have another flight and like, I can't even do math. I have another flight in like six hours. <laughs> like 9.30, like 10, something like that. So I'm just gonna stay up and work, right? Um, like, I no sleep. Man, I look a little, a little bloated, huh? Just had in and out. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm lactose intolerant, so. That's how I look, right? But, uh, man, it's been crazy. It's definitely been crazy. Um, super grateful. I've had... It was an experience where I saw two sides of the spectrum of success, of the pinnacle of success. And it's just a little update video. Um, but one thing I want to talk about is uh, school. So when I flew out, Instagram is here to end there to see where I flew out. Instagram promo, right? Um, but geez, man, it's crazy. I met a multimillionaire who made their success off of, not Shopify, anything like that. It was, uh, they sell to dispensaries. Uh, basically, he's a farmer of weed, <laughs> if you will. And uh, he sells to dispensaries. And he's a college dropout. And when I flew back, I, uh, I met a guy who was a doctor. Incredible experience. I feel like whoever has the higher power up in the sky or in the earth or I don't know aligned it for me to, to see true insight and I'm really happy about that right because uh, I got excited to take up schools but I was deciding I'm to go or not to go but uh, I think I'm gonna go because the guy who told me who's college dropout who's made multiple millions of dollars compared to the guy who was a doctor he was an optometrist who was $200,000 in debt and was looking forward to 15 years so he could pay it off he was 20, I wanna say in his 20s, and the other guy was in his 20s too. He was 26, he told me. And um, he was a multimillionaire, and we were going to, I can't say where, but there was a lot of snow, and uh, it just snowed a lot. And he was just like, yeah, I'm gonna go out and go snowboard with a buddy of mine. And then he plays a lot of golf and stuff like that. And the biggest thing he told me that I wanna pass on to you guys is the biggest thing is, Screw what everybody else says. Just do you. Just do it. Screw them. So what? And that really stuck with me. Just do it. People are going to talk hate because they don't like you. It's jealous. Just do it, guys. <laughs> That's the best way I can put it. Just, just do it. And just stick with it. He said it. He said every step is really hard. It's extremely hard. Every step. He told me the hardest part was when his investors would, went back off, that it'd be hard to get somebody else. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna try to edit this on my brother's computer, see if I could take that to the next city I'm going to. Cause uh, the laptop that I took, it just shows you that you don't need the best quality stuff to start Shopify. <laughs> Cause I started on this little rink dinkity laptop. And uh, yeah, so that's what I wanna share, a little short video. Uh, not that many edits, just Instagram handles. Um, but yeah, man, just do it, guys. Definitely just do it and just work, keep at it, be consistent. Why not, you know? We're all going to this, we're all trying to get the same thing of just freedom, financial freedom to have just time so you don't sleep away to college debt. But I will be going to college. I'll give an update where of um because the, the multimillionaire told me that the point of a college was well the more important class the most important class that he took was accounting and economics and the funny thing is is Mark Cuban told himself like he said if you're gonna go to college and you're just gonna take one class take accounting and um, so yeah I'm major in marketing it's so fun. But we'll see, we'll see what school um, 
yeah, just, just go for the connections. And because uh, you're gonna meet the people, because you're gonna, from high school, he said, he, he looked at his hand and he was like, I can't even count them on my hand. And of um, and <laughs> he was totally stoned out of his mind, honestly. <laughs> so I, I thought it was kind of funny. Of um, And he got his other hand, like, I could count the people I met from college on these two hands. And I was like, and I still keep in contact with them and I still use them for business. And I was like, well, maybe, maybe I'll do some other stuff, you know? I guess we'll see. But yeah, not too many edits. This, it was just my trip. And um, try to post content of um, when I'm in the next city. Take my brother's laptop because this, this is a lot better than mine. But yeah, as you can tell, I'm really tired. And now I'm just going to work. So, <laughs> no sleep. Work hard, play hard. Right, guys? Alright. Peace, guys.